that smoky old pool room in Clear Mountain morning. Mama, oh, babies. Off of one of the breeds. Okay, okay, do that. You're gonna keep in the gray bird? No, not keep it in, but I wanna keep the hair. He's very handy. Put my lighter on him. So you wanna keep the gray hair? Yeah, after you take it out, don't throw it away. Okay, then. Okay. okay. We've been having these braids for a while, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some you of them can tell because it made your hair tangle. Mm -hmm. What's your name? Uh, they call me Gangster Granny. Gangster Granny? Uh-huh. What? <laughs> yeah, well, I rob banks and shit. Uh, yeah. Ow! Sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, I see. You're going to be screaming, really. Good to feel a comb back home again. Huh? To feel a comb go through your hair, it feels good. You haven't seen it for a little while? Ten years. What? Mm. That long? Mm-hmm. I was in Skid Row. You were? I just got my apartment two oh. weeks ago. Walk through hell. Walk through Skid Row. Any woman that's not afraid is crazy as hell. It's like walking through a snake pit, thinking you ain't gonna get bit. And you can make it through there, part of the way. <laughs> and if you do, your brain is such a mess, you wouldn't know it anyway. Even thing in a skid row just wears you out, tires your body. All your nerves tingle. Constantly have to be awake and alert. When I got there, I was just cowgirl. They started trying to play games on me. When I get tired of it, I retaliate. And that's when the title stuck. Try and forget things that happened that were not good. Look, Granny. And they creep back up on you. But if you block it out, it's not coming back. And you don't have to go there no more. Uh, yes. <laughs> Very good. All right, Granny. Well, you caught that. Oh, yes. Uh. All the art equipment in the world, no pencil. 
I'm mascara. Oh yeah. Now what's the protocol? I just uh, throw everything up there yeah, and you just throw everything up here and, and you throw it. everything back. Alright. How are you doing today? Okay. There we go. Whoa. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Extra sour cream. Put uh -huh. extra. I don't want to see the fries under the sour cream. Uh, what kind of uh, beverage do you have? No bacon. A lot of people that had homes in Skid Row, the bank invested your money and lost it. They took your home, your bank account, and left you flat on your ass. Well, he made my chili cheese fries right. I was, I was quite lucrative to have it all go like that. I wonder what the hell happened. What am I doing here? Both my parents were born and raised on farms in Nebraska. And they had to go and move to the city and tell me I'm not normal. I'm not going to tell you my childhood. As a child of abuse by my mother, so I don't even want to go there. Uh -huh. But I love my daddy. He looked good in cowboy hat, I bought him. His birthday. Ah. Don't worry, it's happened a million times. I was out of options on places to stay, and I went to my dad. When my dad could even get down the stairs, he put me in the car and took me to Skid Row. me to that women's center and open the door. And every other week, I'd go and apply for this, that, and the other. You know what they told me? You don't have enough going for you yet. You can't look for help. You're on your own. Well, I know that walk anywhere. Hey, baby, how you doing? <laughs> you look so good. You look so good. Thank you. Good to see you, too. Oh, you're it's a pedicure so that yeah, you'll be able to walk over and visit me. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to walk, but I'll tell them to visit you. Here she go. Here she baby. is. Baby! This is my little, my heart, my little sister. Hi. Hello. Little birdie. Good. Look at you. By the time y'all found me, I've been sending subliminal messages to you for months. Girl, we've been, you've been in our prayers. That's why you get yeah. I see. Well, your prayers are blessing me. Yep. Yeah. Look me a mess of time. Barbara, I cannot see your face. I see the ceiling. Well, then she better hold it. Here, let me hold <laughs> it. Because my, my hand gets relaxed. Now she can see her. Yeah. It looks so pretty. Oh, Lord. Is it all? She misses you. <laughs> I, I'm telling you, I 
I keep you in my prayers all the time. So I'm so happy yeah. God has blessed you and given you a place to stay and everything. About time. Yeah. It's been <laughs> some long times. <laughs> Ooh, goody. <laughs> so did you ever get did you get your place together you said you got a whole bunch yeah. of the plants and stuff uh -huh. where'd you put them right now they're just, like that? they're just in my little uh cave corner you got a cave corner yep my first little corner in there oh. my little corner of the world in the front room and a little caddy corner uh-huh remember that Oh my goodness. <laughs> that me? Yep, that's you. Oh Lord. Look, there's your modeling picture. Golly. You guys <laughs> seeing this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Where did Bernita get these? I told you they were in Dad's photo album. My we goodness. found out, look at this. this is you and Mom and everybody. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Barbie. Every time I sit down, I fall asleep. I'm just tired. Well, you know why? Because now you 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 don't have to yeah, worry I'm about watching too your relaxed. back. Yeah, you don't have to worry about watching your back now. I was still numb, a dream. I was wondering when I was gonna wake up and start crying. You don't think it's the first time somebody dreamed of having a home? That's a constant one. I imagine my neighbors could hear me go, it's real, this is really mine. This is really inside, yay! You know what it's like to go in there and dive in a tub every time you want to? <laughs> oh, I swim around like a little fishy. It's wonderful. I even walked around in my underwear. Yeah. And before then, I went around the whole house and peeked in every window <laughs> and see if anybody could look in and see me. <laughs> Tell me my age. <laughs> Don't I won't dare. Go. It's all coming back to me. How come you don't put these in the closet? Why you got them hidden behind the chair? Because I want to. I want to make sure I, I see them. You want to make sure you see them. In case of emergency, I ain't going to grab none of these city boots. <laughs> what emergency are you looking for? Ain't no telling. <laughs> Look. And it comes with the shams and the extra pillows, oh, too. That's cute. I like that design. Yeah. That's the one she just got. It was supposed to have been here today, but it didn't come. I think those are your towels. That's that, and then those are your pillows. Mm. And she just, um, you know, let her know what else more you want or need. Mm-hmm. And she says she'll see what she can do. 
went over and seen Daddo's house. They redid it. No kidding. I mean, the inside, too, they took, you know how the, when you come down the stairs, it was all wooden and everything? Uh-huh. Hey, that's all banister. Hmm. Yeah. Well, tell me you got your skates. That box right there. What box? That box. The one, the box oh on the box. Oh, my God, no, you don't. Oh, my God. I started to put them on what last night and clean house with them on. Oh, you wasn't? Yes, I was. <laughs> That's why that box is sitting there open. Yeah, we were talking about that the other day. Mm-hmm. Going skating. Uh, you know, our skating rings, those skating rings are gone. Yeah. Um, our, see, the one we had in Hollywood, I think, is the Home Depot now. Oh, man, they didn't. Yes, they did. It's Home Depot. That's sacrilege. And then, <laughs> and then the one on Arlington. That's a monument. You know, hold on, something's changed. You know, sit up. I want to take some pictures of you. Mm -hmm. Send to Bernie and to Beverly. Oh, I like that picture. Oh, it looks so cute. <laughs> uh, oh, I see you've been drawing again, huh? Wait a minute. Yeah, me, Mr. Granddaddy. Oh, ooh. Yeah, ooh. Well, I'm gonna see you tomorrow, dear. Okay. And I love you. I love you too, and thank God. suicidal. I'd commit what I'd call live suicide. Just go to bed and stay there until you figure out a reason to live. But I didn't live. I survived. I existed. I persevered. I even went a little nuts. So here I am, trying to get my wits back around me. Come on home, wits. Here we are. Come back, come back wherever you are. Yeah, you call that living? Oh, hell no. I'm living now. down here almost two years so I met her probably like the first month or two when I was down here and uh, I personally adopted her as my grandma my grandma so she's been my granny since day one do you know any uh, resources here in LA oh, this is my first time I'm mm -hmm. in Minnesota bro okay doc I'm, yeah. I'm Pastor Blue how you doing, Pastor? Uh, no, oh. just so, just so. You from Minnesota? Yeah. And you got no where to go? I got off the bus today. Mm -hmm. I had my first day. Guess me, I've never been here a day in my life. Poor baby. <laughs> Poor baby. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
seems like a wonderful place. Let that be the reason. Yes, ma'am. You said it yourself. Repeat it to yourself. Yes, ma'am. Smoky old pool rooms and clear mountain mornings. They ain't wrong, they're just different, because her pride won't let her do things to make you think she's right. Mama's little babies 